People might be telling you that you're not communicating enough and in your mind, you're probably communicating all the time. So what's the disconnect? It's probably how you're communicating. Are you establishing a rhythm so people can consistently get information from you? And is that rhythm including structure? So you have set agendas, so there's no surprises. What I actively promote with my coaching clients is make sure on Mondays, it's an administrative day. You spend time with your team going over the week ahead operationally, what needs to happen, what do your clients need, what do your customers need, what do your other teams need to be successful so you can get that base covered. Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, during the week, you're spending time one-on-one -on -one with your team. So you're available to them. Remember, they don't work for you, you work for them. On Friday, and this is like a game-changing practice, I highly encourage you to start writing a 15-5. It's an email that takes 15 minutes to write, five minutes for someone to read. It has three sections. The first is highlights from the previous week, so you can celebrate successes. The next section is an on your mind. This just gives you an opportunity to think out loud to your team in a valuable way so they can just know what you're thinking. And the third piece is your week ahead, the following week, just so people know where you're gonna be, what your priorities are. Simple, right? Simply stated, but it doesn't take that much effort to be disciplined in your communications. Give it a try.